It's a very different subject. You can learn a, an instrument, you can learn a, a language, you can learn many things. I don't think you can learn conducting. You can, you can study it, but you cannot learn it. And you can examine it, and you, you have curious what makes it work. You know, the thing is about conducting that every single person is different. Everybody has his own language, and uh, there is no I would say that is not a uni unified technique. What works for one person will not work for another one. A, one person conducts with very small movements, the other one conducts with huge, big movements, and both works. The movement is nothing. It's the ballet is nothing. It's what you want to say is always more important. And if you know what you want to say, you will find a way of saying it. It's very interesting to watch how a spark of consciousness flares up in the student. If you are able to strike with a little spark, then later you can leave that student in peace. That fruit will grow and grow upright. This is a very interesting process. First of all, it's a process. It's a long, long process. Ilgas process.
Taip, kontaktas užsimesga arba neužsimesga per penkias minutės. Kontakt is made and art made in the first five minutes. Some famous orchestra artist, the father of Richard Strauss, to be precise, said that when a conductor walks in, after the first five minutes, we already know who is going to conduct, either him or us. Uh, on the whole, orchestras don't like conductors anyway, and they like young conductors least of all. So it depends on how your uh, chemistry with an orchestra. I mean, the, the difficulty for any conductor is that you go to one orchestra and you're a huge success and everyone loves you and, and two weeks later you go down the road to another orchestra and you do exactly the same thing. And they hate you and you can't understand why. It's just a chemistry. You see, it's a very dangerous profession in a sense because uh, you are so much based on your ego. You know, it's an ego-based thing. You are alone and you have choices. Other people don't have any choices. You have the choice. And you can say, we start and we can stop. Uh, and how much of something, you know. You decide all the time. You, they wait for you. You see, just think of this. If people are in the hole many of them, and you come in alone. And they can't decide when to start. You, you decide already, I start now. The podium, which is 10 or 20 centimeters of the orchestra, sometimes change a person a little. In life, a person may be simple, friendly, but it's enough for him to get to the podium and he becomes someone else. And you think, no, that can be him. Everybody speaks the same, but very difficult to speak the same in the same time. So the conductor is the one who uh, keeps time, who sort of keeps order in activity which is done by many other people. I also would say to him that the conductor is the one who sort of is like somebody when you go to the cinema and you don't find your place uh, after it, the show has started and it's dark. He gets a little, he has a little lamp, you know, the one with the attendant in the cinema and he shows people the, the way. Well, I am a little bit like this. <laughs>